Of course, waking up in a boxable casita, it's amazing. When you receive a boxable casita, everything's done. The whole reason we are doing boxable is to push down the cost of housing. Hey guys, my name is Galliano. Uh, we are here at Boxable in Las Vegas. This is a factory where we are mass producing tiny houses. Welcome into the Boxable Casita. This is our first product. It's a 20 by 20 studio apartment. It's got kitchen, bathroom, bedroom, couch, pretty much everything you need. And the goal is to have the lowest cost housing ever done. Here we are in the, in the kitchen of the Boxable Casita. You can see, even though it is a small space, we've got a, a whole bunch of cabinets. Uh, we do also have full-size appliances, microwave, oven, dishwasher. It's also a very big space. Uh, you know, you'll see that the ceiling height is, is nine and a half feet high. And, um, you know, just, just uh, we've been able to make really great use of, of this, you know, roughly 360 square foot unit. When you receive a boxable casita, everything's done. You know, that includes the plumbing, the LED lighting, the uh, uh, heating and cooling on, on the mini splits. You know, all this stuff is done in the factory. And then when the unit arrives on site, you just kind of unfold it and, and plug in utilities to, to the exterior of the box and, and you're good to go. The goal of the company is to dramatically reduce housing costs through mass production. We got started with Boxable back around 2018. Uh, at that time, it was uh, myself, uh, my father, Paolo, and another guy named Kyle Denman. Uh, really just originally with an idea and, uh, and a website and some pretty pictures that, that we drew and uh, started showing people the idea and pretty quickly got quite a lot of traction and, and now we find ourselves here in this big, big factory. So since we got in here and set up uh, factory one, which is 170,000 feet, um, we're now producing about two houses per day. Uh, we've produced maybe 350 houses uh, so far in, in total. We're still kind of in the development phase. We're still dialing in um, the, the product and, and the process, but we have uh, really big aspirations here to scale this thing uh, absolutely huge and potentially can have a huge impact on, on the whole world to kind of increase people's quality of life. So here we are in the living room of the Boxable Casita. As you can see, you know, it's tiny, but there's, there's a good amount of space in here. So we're able to put in this, uh, this nice little uh, couch here. We've got, uh, you know, big windows, lots of lighting, and then uh, this, this central closet area with this uh, television. This is kind of just, you know, the stock boxable casita, but you can definitely do lots of different customizations to it, pretty much anything you want. Uh, for example, if you wanted to hang something on the wall, you can just screw in pretty much anywhere and, and hang stuff on the wall. Most houses, you know, if you're trying to screw into the wall, you're gonna have to find a stud and that'll limit where you can screw into. Uh, the way our walls are built, it's a different material, so you can pretty much just put a screw in anywhere. So my name is Kyle Denman, I'm the Director of Engineering for Boxable and also one of the founding members of the company. Uh, so I've been working with Paulo and Galliano on Boxable since it was formed. So once the Boxables are built, um, they're set outside to get ready to ship. The major part of the solution is actually the transportation, right? It's the reason that we can build on our production line is because we can ship these things. The reason that everybody else really can't is because you can't ship typical modulars, right? You're talking about overwide permits, crazy amounts of money to ship even more than a couple hundred miles. And then the other thing we have going for us is because of the materials we use and the way that we construct these things, they're lightweight. We're working on a system right now to be able to tandem haul, or even in some odd cases, triple haul casitas with our own trailering system with a pickup truck. Now that's like the main game changer, right? Uh, not needing a semi truck to deliver your house is really pretty insane. So the costs obviously go through the floor when you compare them to anything else. Um, and your maneuverability goes up, right? You can do more stuff with it, right? I don't have to have this crazy big rig trying to come down some weird country road in the middle of nowhere. Once it arrives to site, um, at the moment, we're not really doing a lot of installs. We do some here and there, but we're kind of growing. Um, a lot of things we're doing is trying to train up our customers, which are mostly contractors, into how to actually assemble the units, because um, it is really easy. I mean, we're talking like our guys take like 30, 40 minutes to unfold the, ha unfold the house, and then it's maybe another like hour or two to like secure it, and, and that's, that's it. Then the rest of the work, which usually takes like another like 10, 12 hours past that in reality, is like a lot of like touch up, finish stuff. We're gonna hang sconces, we gotta, you know, hang a cabinet. Like there's a lot of like little, little kind of nuances that you gotta kind of do, um, which we're trying to improve upon with the next generation of design. The consumer ready design, we're trying to cut that number at least in half for the total setup time. I mean, like 
the thing arrives on a truck to like your like, you know, sipping wine on the couch, like done. <sighs> of course, waking up in a boxable casita, it's amazing. We have this massive queen bed. I don't know how many tiny houses usually have queen beds, but we like ours. And uh, of course, the boxable casita closet. Look at that, plenty of space to put all your stuff. Some drawers over here. And then, cool, neat little trick. The TV will actually just spin around so you can watch it. It's pretty nice, this is a studio, but you do kind of have a little privacy over here on this side versus being on the side with the couch. There it is, unfolding. It's magical. So a, a lot of people ask about the ratings of the house and what's the process like to actually install one. And what we've got here is a building system that we think is superior to traditional construction. So for example, all the walls on all our houses have hurricane speed wind ratings on them. So like the boxable casita has stronger walls than the, the walls on, on my house at home. And uh, not just the walls, but the energy efficiency, the, the structural strength, the water resistance, the fire resistance. We've gone to great lengths to dial in the product to exceed all these requirements. And we did that on purpose because we wanted one universal product that we could mass produce that would go everywhere. Versus the current way of doing it now is they'll build a certain way for maybe Miami, Florida high winds, and they'll build another certain way for Southern California uh, earthquakes. So we wanted to just have one product that exceeded everything. And it wasn't easy to, to get that and, and it took a whole lot of research, a whole lot of testing on alternative building materials. And uh, what we've come up with is, is pretty amazing. Uh, we think it's kind of a, a game changer and it's going to allow us to get to that true mass production. Uh, as far as how the building is actually deployed and, and set up on site, it's pretty simple. We've gotten most of the heavy lifting done in our factory. so kitchen, bathroom, plumbing, electric, flooring, windows, like all that stuff is done in our factory. And that's so important because that's the way we're gonna to get to the lowest possible cost to be doing it on an assembly line with standardization, with the lower cost labor, uh, instead of trying to do that all out in the field, you know, one at a time in a custom manner, that's just never gonna be an efficient way to do things. So that being said, you know, you, th this casita arrives on site. You just basically unfold it using a crane or a, or a telehandler or a forklift, and then you throw some, some screws in, it locks into place, and then you're good to go. At that point, you're gonna connect utilities to the exterior. Uh, you may or may not prepare a foundation in advance. Uh, for some use cases, you know, you want a foundation, especially if you're trying to get a building permit. Uh, otherwise, you might just throw it down on some bricks in your backyard. And uh, really, we've, we've gotten almost everything out of the site and, and into the factory. And then beyond that, it's just a matter of customizations. Do you want to add a, a different facade onto it? Do you want to paint it? Do you want to install a, a different roof pitch or a deck or some landscaping and uh, kind of take it from there? Welcome to the Boxable Casita bathroom. As you can see, it's extremely spacious and we have this amazing sliding glass door. Once again, lots of uh, storage space, you know, in the, uh, in the boxable casita. We, we threw cabinets in pretty much everywhere. Uh, and then we have this cool heated mirror and uh, this, this nice sink. Here we are in the boxable shower. As you can see, you know, tall, eight foot tall shower, uh, plenty of space. We actually custom engineered this. You can see there's a boxable logo in there and, um, you know, some space for your your, your soap here and uh, you know make sure you, you get nice and clean. When we first started the company we, we just went to Home Depot and we bought a shower and uh, frankly couldn't find a, a great solution, couldn't find something that we think cost the right amount or provided the features we needed so we ended up engineering our own uh, shower uh, from scratch and um, you know it's, it's a better way for us to do it. So lots of little things like that going on in our assembly line to try and push down the cost, bring up the quality and uh, really deliver on, on the boxable mission which is to dramatically reduce housing costs for everyone. So at Boxable, when we started off, we said we have this building system and what should we do next? We decided to focus in on the Casita product and that we would target that to kind of backyard accessory dwelling units you know, that you see as kind of like backyard apartments. But 
of course, the, the idea here is, is a full building system where you can connect and stack different rooms and build many different building types. So we actually do stack the boxable casitas right now. The, currently, we're shipping houses to a, a workforce housing in Arizona where we're doing a two-story. So we basically have four boxable casitas and then another four boxable casitas on top of that stacked up. And then we just debuted at the building show actually a, a full house, a thousand square foot house made out of these boxable room modules there. So it's the same room as the casita, but uh, one of them has uh, one bedroom, one of them has uh, uh, two bedrooms, and then the other is like a living room and, and, and kitchen. And at the Builder Show, we decided to showcase this to expand people's understanding of what Boxable was beyond Tiny House. So we took uh, those two boxes, connect them together, and then put another box on top, and then actually had a roof deck. Uh, so you can check that out, and it's really, really nice, and uh, just a great example of what's to come for Boxable. So the Boxable Casita can totally be financed. The whole Boxable building system can pretty much going to use all the standard financing options that would apply to a traditional house, a traditional mortgage, a traditional RV financing. All that stuff should work great for a Boxable Casita. The whole reason we are doing Boxable is to push down the cost of housing. It costs way too much for people to just live in a house. And uh, the reason that's happening is because the way we're building. No other modern product is built by craftsmen one at a time in a custom manner out on site. Uh, nothing else is, is done that way. So we think that by bringing housing onto the mass production assembly line and just building the way we're already building everything else, that we're gonna be able to push down housing costs and hopefully put out incredible amounts of housing at an incredibly low price all around the world and, and have a huge impact. All right, guys, thank you so much for coming to check out the Boxable Casita and the Boxable Factory. If you're interested to learn more, please go to our website, boxable.com. Check out our social media channels, our YouTube, our Instagram, pretty much everything we've done at this company from the beginning. We've posted it live to social media, so lots of exciting updates happening nonstop on there. Anyway, I got to get back to work, so get out of here.